Good question. Uh, the rationale is that people with disabilities are disproportionately affected in wars and conflicts. Access to air raid shelters and bomb shelters is, uh, is non-existent. They're not wheelchair accessible, they're not disability friendly in any way. When bombs go off in streets, it completely changes the landscape of the streetscape. Uh, and so getting to and from basic location shops and that is next to impossible. We were contacted by an organization in Kiev uh, who looked uh, for support and help from, from Walk directly. Uh, and we then took it upon ourselves to drive over. We met four families on the, the Polish border, Polish-Ukraine border, uh, and brought them back to Ireland with us. Probably for the same reason, uh, we have been contacted again by another family who are, are stuck in a city on the west of Kiev that has been completely destroyed. They have no access to, or basic access to food and, and water, uh, and have no access uh, and no ability to, to leave the city in, because of physical disabilities and the lack of transport. We're bringing humanitarian aid over to hum some humanitarian centers uh, and to an organization directly in Kiev who will deliver it locally to families of people with disabilities and older people who are struggling uh, at this time. So what we're really looking for is, is people to get on board with the GoFundMe page that's been set up by Walk uh, and our um, to provide some humanitarian aid, it's basic provisions, uh, dry goods, dry foods. We'll be delivering it directly to, uh, to organizations in Kiev who will be meeting us on the border. It's walk.ie or joe at walk.ie um, or uh, joe mason. Uh, at walk um, 087 922 786 or 01 465 0388. Any help is really appreciated. There is a GoFundMe page set up, uh, and, and that link is on walk.ie. Everybody, this is Yeveni, he's 14 years of age, originally from Irpin, now living in Wexford. Yeveni, what's it like to live in Ireland? I like uh, living in uh, Ireland. Uh, Ireland. Uh, your family is very grateful uh, uh, to everyone help and support. But, I, uh, some, but sometimes I miss uh, because I don't, uh, I don't have friends here. Okay. And do you like living in Wexford? Yeah. Near the beach? Mm, yeah. yeah. So, Yveni, will you come to see Shamrock Rovers play in the stadium someday? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Right. That's a date. <laughs> I'm very thankful all uh, uh, people from work and especially Joe and Catherine. She, uh, they surround us uh, attention, care. Uh, they solved uh, all our problems. To be honest, I'm very worried uh, before uh, this trip uh, because my English is not perfect and uh, we did not uh, we did not know where we live, where uh, uh, how we get uh, necessary medicine, and uh, they very help us. And, and I'm never forget that uh, for their help. Thank you. <laughs> 